Hey there, welcome to you in my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to add same page smooth scroll to Anchor in Shopify. If you are learning Shopify theme customization and Shopify theme development, then you can continue this video. So, let's get started. Before I start this tutorials, I want to share the behind story. Look here. This is my client's website and he wanted the same page smooth skull in her website. And I have already added this P chart in this website, but I want to share the full process with all of my audience. So I look at my mouse when I click on the how can I help you button. Scroll down in this section how can I help you and if I click on the my book button it's scroll down to the my book section again if I click on the how can I help you go to the how can I help you section here is the message that my client sent me by Upwork let me share hi again Faisal hope you're good so just the last video for today uh, it's just on the on this section here so when people say can i help can you help it goes to this section here so it'll be nice that if people say how you can help is they come to here because I am, I am going to do a well a video here to explain what i do what i'll do as well is i'll, I'll make this title just one line it should be cool so hopefully when people click how can i help hopefully it'll scroll down and they'll just see the title and this video and this section here to be cool also as well when someone clicks the books is it possible so again yes yeah, so when people click books my books it scrolls down i hope you understand that what was my client's requirement okay so now i'm going to start at this picture one by one so first of all i am going to my shopify admin panel here is my shopify admin panel then click on the online store then click on the action button edit code here i'm going to create a custom js file click on the asset folder add a new asset click on the create a blank file add custom js okay we have created our custom js file and now click on the custom js file here to open it and here i am going to add some js code here is my js code then click on the save now open theme liquid file and here i am going to link my custom js file just going to add the custom js file under script right here so i'm going to type my code skip tag okay we have done then click on the save now we have to add css id in the menu navigation we have to find the id of this section so i'm going to open developer tools and trying to find the id of the section here is the section id just copy this id and go to my navigation and this id for how can i help you section we have copied this section id and now i'm going to open the navigation and here is the how can i help you menu item and now we have to add our section id right here then click on the apply change in the same process we have to find out the id of the section here is the id of book section copy this id and 
open the book menu item add your id right here then apply change and finally click on the save changes okay we have done we have finished our all the process now i'm going to reload or refresh my browser and click on the how can i help you button wow my book that's working so nice so thank you for your time to watch this video if you think this video is helpful then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel have a nice day